In this video, I'll be covering with you on how to compute scores. Now, if you still remember, uh, going back to my previous videos, this is the uh, research model that we had. Yeah, We had our variables attitude, subjective norm, perceived behavioral control, and this is our dependent variable, which is intention. So what we have done so far in SPSS, we have just key in the items. For example, if we talk about attitude, these are the three items that we have keyed in, yeah? but we have not determined our variable score yet. Yeah? So what we have to do is that for every single variable, attitude, subjective norm, perceived behavioral control and intention, we need to determine the score. So technically what will happen is that now you will have a solid variable. And how do we get the solid variable? The solid variable is the mean score of these three items. For example, attitude, ATTR1, ATTR2, ATTR3, we are going to calculate the mean so that we get a variable score for attitude. Yeah, so I'm going to show you using SPSS on how to calculate the scores. Okay, so in SPSS, what you have to do, you go to transform, compute variable. Now you have to write the name of your variable here, yeah, which is, for example, we were talking about attitude. Yeah, attitude. And you move to the function group here. In the function group, you go to statistical. Yeah, you click on statistical. You go to mean. Okay, when you tick on mean, so they will give you some certain description here. You just have to click this small arrow over here. Yeah, you click on this arrow. So now they've already given us the formula here to calculate the mean value, yeah? So what you do, we're going to calculate for attitude. There are three items. You click on attitude. Then you type here two. You don't have to go all one by one. Space. You click on attitude number three. Yeah, so it means that we want all the three variables. Yeah, so once you have ready key in, in the function, what you do, you go to OK. And now we can go to our variable view here. Can you see attitude here? Yeah, they have already created the mean scores. And if you go to variable view, can you see there's a variable here called attitude. Now what you have to do, you have to now create for all your variables, yeah, based on your model. And you have to do one by one because these are the mean scores that you are going to use in order for you to run your analysis. So if you see over here, I have created all my four variables. And from the data view, you can see over here as well, I have the mean score for all the four variables.